26 year old gentleman who came to us with very sudden severe sharp headache uh, very very severe in nature and followed by drowsiness after that so because of that he underwent an mri investigation and mri brain showed that there was a tumor in the pituitary region so which means a cellular region this area of uh, brain is called as pituitary gland this gland is responsible for secretion of all important hormones the thyroid hormone growth hormone sex hormones hormones cortisol hormone which is a stress hormone so it is where most one of the most important parts of the brain and it is important to keep the patient alive and also for normal human being for their normal well being and development now the tumor in this region was large and it bled this particular thing is called a apoplexy apoplexy sometimes can be life threatening and sometimes the bleed is so large that the nerves of the eye can also get affected and patient can become blind luckily there was no element of blindness although his hormones went down because of the bleed so we had to replace the hormone first once he regained senses and then he was perfectly fine for surgery now he is undergoing surgery which is an endoscopic surgery to remove the tumor along with the bleed so this is the region of the tumor as you can appreciate this is the nose so we go from here through an endoscope to take the tumor out and come out this surgery is done through nose there is no cut in the brain it is done by irrigation guides through endoscope the scope goes through the nose into the base of the skull we drill that part of the skull and we remove the tumor so this is called as an endoscopic transnasal transferoidal surgery which is under neural navigation guidance we are hopeful that we will be able to remove the tumor completely so now he is debriding the ponytail is debriding the tissue making a space for uh, our instruments to pass through it we have still not reached the tumor we are at the base of the skull we are just clearing the area so when we will reach the tumor I'll So as expected in the scan, it was a difficult anatomy, and uh, we were able to find it with neuro navigation. So neuro navigation helps us in reaching where we are. That was a, a beautiful advantage of this technology that precisely we can locate the tumor without damaging the surrounding structures. Surgery went well. We will keep him in ICU for one day, probably three days in ward, and maybe after fourth or fifth day we should be able to discharge.